Hey friends, in this video we are going to build a F450 quadcopter drone with the help of Pixoc flight controller. Here we are using 1000 kV 4 brushless motor. Since we are building quadcopter drone, so we require 4 of them. Here we are using DJI F450 quadcopter frame. These nuts are provided to tie our motors with the arms with the help of Allen key. We have to put the wires of brushless motor downward of our frame so that they doesn't collide with our propeller. This is 30 ampere Simon ESC, means electronic speed controller which is going to control the speed of our brushless motor. This is bottom plate as well as the soldering plate of our drone frame. To solder all wires of ESC here we need a soldering gun as well as soldering iron. We have to solder red wire in the positive terminal and black wire in the negative terminal. Here we will solder 4 ESCs and one battery connector. These nuts are provided to fix the arms with our bottom plate as well as upper plate. We have to tie all these nuts with the help of Allen key. While making this drone, you may require 1mm, 1.5mm and 2mm Allen keys. After this, tie all the ESCs with the help of tape or a zipper. Now we need to connect all our motors to our ESCs. Using this diagram, I want to show you the clockwise motor and anti-clockwise motor connections. For a clockwise motor connection, you just need to connect the motors and ESCs wire simultaneously. But if it is not behaving like a clockwise, then interchange the connection between red and black wires and you will see a opposing direction. This is the quadcopter motor layout of our drone, which displays the numbering of motors as well as their directions. This is the upper plate of our drone, which we need to tie with the help of same nuts, which we have used to tie the bottom plate. Since here we are using our GPS, so we need a GPS holder. This is Radio Link Pixoc 2.4.8 flight controller with anti vibration plate. It is mandatory to use the anti vibration plate so that the drone vibration could be cut off from the flight controller. Always remember the forward direction of our drone should match with the forward direction of our flight controller and this arrow displays the same. We have to fix the ESCs given in the main out according to the numbering shown in the motor layout. But first of all we need to learn that signal wire is of yellow color, positive wire is of red color and negative wire is of black color. And we have to put negative wire in the upper direction, mean a black wire should be in upper side and the signal wire which is a yellow wire should be in a lower side. We are using FlySky IA6B6 channel receiver with a FlySky I6 transmitter. We have to connect our RC in cable to the first channel of our receiver which is also a PPM. This is a buzzer provided with flight controller. Connect it on a buzzer port. This is a safety switch which is provided with fix for a safety purposes. 
This is a ready to sky MA10 GPS which is compatible for Pixock. It comes with a 6 pin connector because 5 pin connector would not fit in a Pixock. Fix the 6 pin connector in a GPS port and fix the I2C pin in the I2C port. Here I am using dual GPS. This is a M7 in GPS which is made for APM but I am using here it for our Pixock. Although it comes with 5 pin connector but I have added a 6 pin connector in this to connect with our Pixock. Although if you are using a dual GPS it is always recommended that use the GPS of same bond rate. Connect its GPS cable into a telemetry 2 port and no need to do anything with I2C cable. This is a 3DR power module. Here we are using it to monitor our battery voltage. It also comes with a 6 pin connector which we have to fix pin up power port of our Pixock. We are also going to use a telemetry so that we can watch the real time data of our drone. It also comes with a 6 pin connector and we have to connect this to a telemetry 1 port of our Pixock. Here we are putting some parts in our frame so that we can increase the ground clearance of our drone as well as we can use the larger batteries. Now our drone is ready for programming. We need a type B USB cable. Connect a cable to a laptop and then to a flight controller and press the factory reset button but before starting programming we need to bind our transmitter with our receiver. Fix the bind cable in a bind port of our receiver. Connect the battery. And you will see a red LED blinking in the receiver. Now press the bind key of our transmitter and while keeping it pressed on your transmitter. And you will soon see that blinking LED turns into a solid red LED. Remove the bind key, disconnect the battery and connect it again. In our transmitter we are going to use a PPM output. Now follow the same procedure and steps as shown in this video. After uploading the firmware, remove the USB cable and connect the telemetry. Now you can program your flight controller wirelessly.
you may also change the flight modes as per your requirement. Hey kid, don't ever let the Since we have used a 3DR power module to monitor the battery voltage, but we are not going to do any configuration for that since it is not working well. Don't let them guide your life towards regret. I'll fight for what I love with every now we are going to check the rotating directions of our motor. Motor 1 is rotating in a counterclockwise direction. Motor 2 is also rotating in a counterclockwise direction. Motor 3 is rotating in a clockwise direction. And motor 4 is rotating in a clockwise direction. If the directions of your motor doesn't match with this diagram, you just need to interchange the red and black wire connections of our motor to the ESC. Here we are using two pairs of propellers. They'll try to kick you while you're down. Using this propeller mount, we are going to attach a propeller to our brushless motor. These are provided with our brushless motor. Attach the clockwise propeller in a clockwise motor and anti-clockwise propeller in an anti-clockwise motor. We can connect a telemetry to our mission planner in our laptop or in our mobile phone. When connected in mobile phone, we need to download a mission planner app from a Play Store. Just connect your telemetry using OTG to your mobile phone and enjoy the real-time data of your drone. They don't wanna see me naked, they don't wanna see me care Anytime I make some progress, I can see that they compare I think everyone's against me, maybe something in the air Am I paranoid? I swear a void is forming And they're scared I walk a straight path Not many can say that, I'd like to play fast Cross me and there's payback, you better pray that I don't see your face at any place that I go I know you hate that, I've been doing fine I'm not wasting any more time I live for the fight and the climb And I think that the pain that's deep inside Is what defines So I won't give up, I'm gonna make it to the top I don't 